First, thank you for buying the automatic word puzzle maker. Uh, we're going to go through a quick video to show you the best way to copy and paste a crossword puzzle into a PowerPoint document. You can see I've already saved this as an editable file. So now once you've done that, scroll down to the crossword puzzles. Uh, click anywhere on the puzzle and this uh, icon should show up in the upper left. Right click on that icon and click copy. There are actually two ways that you can uh, best paste this into a PowerPoint document. So right click, you should get these icons and the first option is to embed. So click that and then we'll paste it here. Drag it around as we, as we please and then we can do the same with the clue tables. Copy that, paste it as embedded, drag it down here and we'll copy the down table. Unfortunately, you have to copy and paste the across clues and the down clues separately because they're in different tables. So we'll paste that as an embedded. Similarly, I'm going to go back and, and copy the main puzzle table again, or I could copy the uh, answer key if I wanted to. So right click copy and we'll go to the PowerPoint and paste this as a picture is also another good way to do it. And you might be thinking to yourself right now, well both of these puzzles look pretty bad. So if you zoom in, the lines are actually all there. And so these puzzles will look good if you print them or if you save them as a PDF. Uh, it's just that you're zoomed out so far, some of the lines don't show up. Now if that's not uh, acceptable for your product and you need it to look good in a PowerPoint document, there is something that you can do to make the lines thicker. If we go back to the original Word Puzzle Maker document and open that up, go to the Review tab and click on this Restrict Editing icon, you'll get this menu here. If you click Stop Protection, that will unprotect this document, so be careful not to change anything that you're not sure will, will mess up the Puzzle Maker. If you scroll down to the Crossword Puzzle and click anywhere in the puzzle, you'll get these tabs, the Table Tools Design and Layout. If you click on the Table Tools Design and change this um, border thickness to whatever you want. So we'll just make it six points to, to make a point here. This changes the default line style for when you make the puzzles. So if we were to go in and remake this crossword puzzle, few minutes you'll see that the puzzle has been created with these thick six point lines so using that method you can make the line thickness whatever you need it to be you can even change the line color if you want thank you again for buying the automatic word puzzle maker always feel free to send us your comments and questions to automatic word puzzle maker at gmail.com and we hope you enjoy the product